guys what's up so appetite type here and today i'm showing you guys um pretty much this post that should be on the screen right now um so this is a reddit post guys so someone asked if there's a tweet to install apps that are not available in their country or region which would actually be really really cool i can tell you times that like i'm in the u.s so like i'm in the u.s apple store and i can tell you times i try to download an app and it says unavailable because you know it's different the apps available in different region or country which gets a little annoying so i kind of do see where this person's coming from um and i would think a tweak that can just automatically fix that would be great or just having everything in one region would be great too i don't know why it has to be different regions to begin with but i guess there's regions and it is what it is so um there are two ways you guys can uh pretty much install apps or games from the app store that's in a different country or region than you are um first off you have two options the first option is change your apple id to um the country region you're trying to install the app from app or game from from the app store the other option um, is a little lengthy, but pretty much to create another app, a new Apple ID um, in that country or region to download the app or game from the App Store from. So the first option, like I said, change your own app ID. I should just go and try doing this first. It doesn't work. Do the other second option, which I'll show you. Um, go to your little profile on here, and you just want to tap on um, your little profile. So you tap on like your email, or your name, whatever, and then put your touch ID or password in, and it's going to bring you this uh, feed settings right here. And you guys want to go over to country or region. And this is the first method, guys, how to change it. So for me, it's not letting me change it, but it might let you guys change it. I don't know. I'm on iOS, I think, 14 on this device. I'm not sure why. You might have to do it from, like, your Mac. So you definitely try it from your Mac to try to change it or country region, and it might let you. And the other option, guys, is um, pretty much the website to create a new app ID. So like I said, you guys, if it's not working on the iPhone, your iPhone, um, to change your app ID. Like, I mean, change your region on your app ID. Then I would definitely recommend try like, doing it on a computer, like a Mac and you know sign into your app id and try changing it on there so second option always should work because you're creating a new app id in that region so um yeah you want to tap on yes you literally could just search up like create new app id in google and then tap on the first link and then you could tap on that link right there and it's going to show you pretty much the steps to do it and yeah so create app id and you also you could do one like on mac windows um on your phone so on the iphone you pretty much just uh you know create it inside the app store like literally you sign out and then tap on create new app id you also could uh do it from the uh, website so it tells you how to do it on each device i mean you also create on a windows pc as well and yeah okay so i guess they used to have a website to do it on i'm not sure they sold that website it's probably changed over to the website. So tell me what device you have, you tap on here and it gives you a tutorial on how to do it. If you forgot your password, you tap on I forgot the apple.com right there. And uh, yeah, that's how you gotta try to retrieve your password. So yeah guys, thank you so much for watching. Oh, there we go, it's still website. So, there you go, query app ID. And there you guys go. So yeah, thanks so much for watching. I will catch you guys next one and peace.